But how does it make you feel that people be, might be making these judgments that you're not happy at all? Well, that's when I can get a snarl on my face going and say, fuck them, who cares what they think? <laughs> Someone made a comment, Mark, and they said that you don't look very happy. That's a bit strange. They don't even know you, but what do you have to say about that? It's an interesting comment, mate. Um, I, I have a view on happiness. I, happiness is not something that can be measured. Like it's, as far as I'm concerned, it's immeasurable. And happiness is relative, when it comes to me, is relative to how I might have felt Minute by minute, I might be feeling a little bit better than I was two hours ago. I might be feeling a little bit worse than I was two hours ago because I just. So therefore, I find the whole concept of what happiness is as not only confusing, but also a nonsense. I take the view it's the important thing is to be just like happy enough, happy enough with what you're doing at the particular time, based on all the constraints that are involved in your environment. If you're happy enough, in other words, accept everything that's happening, accept all the things that are coming at you, it doesn't mean just because you're not smiling, you're not happy enough. I might be just contented, and therefore not smiling. Um, you know, um, you don't have to walk around with a massive smile on your head all the time. So my view on happiness is, sure, everybody seeks happiness. I actually say seek happy enough. Seek to be happy enough. The most important thing that we're looking for is peace, peace of mind. So I think that transcends happiness by far. Peace of mind is the most important thing. To me, if I could feel peace of mind in relation to everything that I see, everything that I, I touch and involved with, and everything that I influence, then I'll be really happy. Until that point comes, I'm happy enough to be happy enough. And for the sake of it, I do smile a lot, just that I don't do it always on camera. But how does it make you feel that people be, might be making these judgments that you're not happy at all? Well, that's when I can get a snarl on my face going and say, fuck them, who cares what they think? I don't think people should make judgments about my happiness. Um, maybe they're making judgments on their own happiness or everybody else's happiness, and they're sort of avoiding um, considering their own happiness. So, yeah, I don't really get where people can make those judgments about the way I look when they don't even know me. Um, I, I love what I do. I actually love having these conversations. I mean, I, I, when I say I love it, I, I, I enjoy it. I, I'm, I get excited by it. And sometimes when I express myself, maybe I'm so excited I'm expressing myself and maybe it looks like I'm cranky. I don't know. But like, I, I am happy enough. And um, so for those individuals who think I'm not, well, you're fucking wrong. And uh, this is me. This is as good as it gets for me. And I'm happy. Uh, do you think people are allowing others to set the bar for happiness, what happiness is, or defining happiness, like through Instagram? things like that. Totally, to like totally. I mean, uh, we, we live in a world where because everything's in two dimensions in front of us all the time, so in other words, it's not just conceptual. We're not just hearing about it, we actually see it. We see photographs um, all the time. But, you know, our whole, our whole life is about seeing photographs, videos, or audio, and photographs. And what we tend to do spatially is we tend to um, make a judgment on the way that person individual looks. And then we try to measure it. We have this major predilection around Measurement, we need to measure everything. How much money someone's got, uh, what a great life someone's got. That word great is a, a, a measurement, how happy that person individual looks like. Oh, and then we refer back to us. So if I think you're really happy, I'm, one way I can make that decision is um, measure what I see in you relative to what I feel in myself. And all of a sudden I'm making measurements and I'm doing it relatively. So it's a mistake. Your happiness, is not relative to anybody else. Your happiness is what you feel inside of yourself. And that comes down to things like, as I said earlier, peace of mind. Do you have peace of mind? Fulfillment, do you feel fulfilled? Do you have a good family? Do you 
uh, enjoy going to work? I mean, are you, do you have an opportunity to say what you want to say? Are you have an opportunity to think the way you want to think? Are you living a free life? You know, and what I mean by that is you're not walking around in chains and locked up in a prison. So you need to think about that for yourself. And that's how you come up with the concept of being happy enough. Don't go trying to chase happiness or superbness or supremeness or, you know, greatness. Just be happy within yourself pushing out good stuff. That's what I reckon is the game. And don't worry about how everybody else seems.